Hey guys, Michael Hill, Florida. Today we're going to be showing you how to tie a perfection loop. All right guys, for demonstration purposes, I'm going to be using paracord first, and then I will jump into mono and show you guys with mono. First thing we're going to do is take our paracord, about 12 inches, and putting our tag end and our pointer and thumb finger, if you just make a snapping motion, it'll naturally want to form a loop. And the main thing about this is having this tag end behind your main line. We're going to do the same exact thing. We're going to form another loop just by pinching and twisting. This time we're going to go behind the loop and then put everything in our hand nice and properly. So now you have the first loop you made, you have the second loop you made, and the tag end. We're going to put this tag end between both of the loops we just made and then go in between from behind and grab the second loop and pull everything tight. To cinch this knot, I like to pull both lines in the beginning and then really just cinch on this one tight. But that's going to be the done loop and we could go jump into mono real quick and I'll show you with that. Alright guys, now jumping into the mono. It's going to be a little hard to see this, but I'm going to try my best. So we got our 12 inches of mono right here. First thing I'm going to do is take our tag in our right hand. Like I said, if you just make a small snapping motion, it'll naturally create the loop in the proper format. So just kind of roll your fingers. As you can see, this tag end is behind the standing line. So we have a loop in our left hand, just pinching that loop. With our tag end again, we're going to just roll our fingers one more time, but instead going behind that first loop that we made. And then get everything situated in your left hand. Then we're going to take this tag end, and then we have our first loop here, our second loop here. We're going to go in between both of those loops and pinch it right there. So now we have our first loop, our second loop, and our tag end in between. We're going to come from behind that first loop that we made, pinch the second loop we made, and bring it through that first loop. And then that's going to be the done knot. So that's going to be your perfection loop right there. As you can see. I actually do like to come in here, cut this tag end, and burn it just a little bit with a lighter and kind of mushroom out the side. It makes the knot snag free basically. You could also coat it with a little bit of loon or zap or any kind of glue that you'd like. Just wanted to jump in here to say thank you guys for watching. If you want to see more content like this, head over to our YouTube page and we hope to see you out on the water.